In today's video, we're gonna be looking at an inverting swinging mine train western coaster, the swing thing. And boy, oh boy, does this look incredible. It's a coaster that does something unique and you're not gonna to wanna to miss out. So stay tuned and let's get right on into it. Hey yo, my Planet Coaster friends, Johnny Five Alive here, and welcome back to another episode of Coaster Spotlight. Today we're looking at the swing thing created by Benutzernam, one of our Discord advanced builders. And here they say, Hi everyone, this is my first submission ever. I've been some years here on Discord, I think, and I like to watch your videos and streams. But now I decided to submit, submit for a spotlight. It started as a fun project, but I spent very much effort into it. I thought, yes, this should be my first submission. So what's the swing thing? The swinging mine train with a launched and looping. So maybe it's not absolute realistic. <laughs> I, I heard every coaster should have a story. So here it is. There once was a legend deep in the desert of the glowing rocks. The legend says there that there are very gr rare green diamonds that the legend is not saying is these are haunted. Much people searched for the green diamonds. Many tried, many died. Now there's the last cowboy. Will he survive? Please seat view first, first row, train one, and that is the best ride experience. Thank you very much for showing it your favorite username. All right. I just want to give an extended shout out to Benutzernam. He is also doing spotlights and uh, whatnot on his channel. I'll try to put a link down in the description below. If not, you can also click the link to this submission, go to his Steam page, and there will be a link to his YouTube channel from there. So he also does Planet Coaster spotlights and creations like that. So let's show some love for Benutzernam. Go give him a sub and let's get right on into this creation. All right, ladies and gentlemen, here we are at the swing thing. This is really cool. So I was messing around with my reshade just a little bit and I added in an extra foggy, dusty I should say, not foggy but dusty setting. If we can take a look at it here, this is original Planko, this is the uh, reshade. It also helps to pop these little details as you can see this building, this is before, this is after. It really does accentuate these certain details, so I thought this would be a fun way to get to uh, make it feel a little bit more realistic with these settings. So let's head on down to this queue. We have this really crazy swing thing up there. It's looking cool. Let's head on into the boarding station here. The swing thing. It's a swinging mine train coaster with inversions. Uh, let's take a look at all the ride stats here. 66 miles per hour, 810 meters in length, 60 seconds in duration, 5 airtime counts, 3.4 seconds of airtime, and 2 massive inversions. Let's get to it. Ride this in a few perspectives, starting with the seat view. Did you see the pink penguin with the axe in the head? Hold the phone. Hold the phone. Oh my god. <laughs> That's incredible. All right, let's check this out at the back of the train here. I want to... Uh, actually, we'll just do chase. Woohoo!
created by Bunutsunam. Hopefully I'm saying that right. I butcher everybody's name. Does it have any nighttime lighting? Oh. Ooh. The red rock glow. It actually looks really good here. Usually I wonder why everybody makes it glow. Let's uh, check it out at nighttime here. This looks fantastic. There it is, ladies and gentlemen. I actually quite enjoyed that more during nighttime here. It's so, uh, I mean, the reshade helps a little bit too. I don't know if you guys like it or dislike it. I think this is a little bit too cartoony, but then it actually, so when you do light up the red rocks, it does make it feel a little unnatural. But when you have the reshade on, it kind of works, kind of works. I like it. So I've been messing around with this reshade. I don't think I have just quite the right settings yet. Uh, I'm gonna have to talk to a few experts in the, the field here. Uh, I'm just happy that I got it working for once. I still run into a couple errors here and there. I'm iffy about certain settings, but overall I think it's enhancing the look and feel of these coaster and park spotlights. So I'm still keeping my eye out uh, for your comments and I'm gonna be checking to see See what you guys think of it but uh to bring the focus back around to Benutzernam, i think it did enhance your creation but your creation looks absolutely fantastic with or without it and uh this was a fun fun coaster spotlight i uh i really like what you did here with the big swing thing gigantic inversion on a swinging mine train coaster the rock work looks nice the custom supports are really fun you know they got good usage of the foliage here a beautiful boarding station and uh it's fun, good to finally see a submission a first time ever submission from Banutsernam, and uh, an incredible one at that so really good job keep up the good work and uh once again go go give him a, a sub to his channel you guys let's let's get him some extra views some extra subs and um you know show that planet coaster community love to another fantastic as a creator. All right, everybody, that is Benutzernam's, Benutzernam's swing thing. What did you think? Leave a comment down below for him. And thank you all so much for watching. I hope you have a fantastic day, and I'll see you in the next episode. Bye now.